Now let us move on to the second bit of the question. So the second decimal expansion given is 0 0.47 bar. So we shall assume the given decimal expansion as x. Therefore x is equal to 0 0.47 bar which is 0 0.477 so on. Consider this as equation 1. Since one digit is repeating in the given expansion, we multiply equation 1 with 10. That is, 10 times x is equal to 10 times 0 0.47 bar. This gives 10x is equal to 4.7 bar. This is 4.777, so on. Here, 4.77 so on can also be written as 4.3 plus 0 0.477 and so on. So, this is 10x is equal to 4.3 plus 0 0.47 bar. So, now from the obtained equation, we shall subtract x from both LHS and RHS. So now 10x minus x is equal to 4.3 plus 0 0.47 bar minus x. So we have 10x minus x is equal to 9x which is equal to 4.3 plus 0 0.47 bar minus x is equal to 0 0.47 bar from equation 1. Therefore, 9x is equal to 4.3. Hence, x is equal to 4.3 by 9, which is 43 by 90. Therefore, the p by q form of the given decimal expansion 0 0.47 bar is 43 by 90 where p and q are integers and q is not equal to 0. Let us move on to the third bit of the question. The third decimal expansion given is 0 0.001 bar. So we shall assume x is equal to 0 0.001 bar which is equal to 0 0.001, 0 0.001 and so on. Consider this as equation 1. Since in the given decimal expansion, 3 digits are repeating, we shall multiply equation 1 with 1 followed by 3 zeros, that is 1000. Therefore, 1000 times x is equal to 1000 times 0 0.001 bar. This is 1000x is equal to 1.001 bar. This can be written as 1000x is equal to 1 plus 0 0.001 bar. Consider this as equation 2. Now let us subtract equation 1 from equation 2. Therefore, 1000x is equal to 1 plus 0 0.001 bar minus x is equal to 0.001 bar. 1000x minus x gives 999x is equal to here we are left over with 1. So 999x is equal to 1 which implies x is equal to 1 upon 999. Therefore the p by q form of the given decimal expansion 0.001 bar is 1 by 999 where 1 and 999 are integers and the denominator is not equal to 0. Now let us move on to the fourth question. The fourth question is express 0 0.999 so on in the form of p by q. Are you surprised by your answer? With your teacher and classmates, discuss why the answer makes sense.
so let's go for the solution so now we shall express the given decimal expansion that is 0 0.999 and so on in the form of p by q so let us assume x is equal to 0 0.9 bar consider this as equation 1 since in the given decimal expansion one digit is repeating we shall multiply equation 1 with 1 followed by 1 0 that is 10 so we have 10 times x is equal to 10 times 0 0.9 bar this gives 10x is equal to 9.9 .9 bar this can be written as 10x is equal to 9 plus 0 0.9 bar consider this as equation 2 now we shall subtract equation 1 from equation 2 that is 10x is equal to 9 plus 0 0.9 bar minus x is equal to 0 0.9 bar 10x minus x is equal to 9x which is equal to 9 therefore we have 9x is equal to 9 which implies x is equal to 1 therefore the p by q form of the given decimal expansion 0 0.999 and so on is 1 we can also say by observation that 0 0.999 and so on is approximately equal to 1 which is a rational number